We are at the rocks. Got the old big beef stick. Here we go. Oh, we got bit by something. That's cold. Yeah, we got something. We got splash too. Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back, or at least it's morning for me. It's morning for me. So this is uh, the start of the vacation vlog. So we're going down to the beach. Got my truck, I had to block in the U-Haul. Dude, I cannot tell you, traveling with a one-year-old toddler, whatever you want to call her, um, freaking sucks. There's a whole lot of stuff, so we had to rent like a U-Haul. We're about to head out of here. So, hope you guys are gonna enjoy this video. It's gonna be, I don't know, over one, two, three, I don't know how many days until I get something good worth putting on here. But this is just an introduction, and uh, I love all the OG fans that enjoy watching this stuff as I document. This is more documentation for me. Let's freaking go. Holy crap, that was a long drive. Um, we left at what, eight? And it's 4.30. We did have to stop at a grocery store and get some food, but there she is. We're about to go to the, we're about to let her see the beach for the first time. Uh, she was good, a good little car rider up until about the last hour. And uh, then she had freaking had enough. And you know what? I don't blame her. I'd had enough too. So let's uh, let's let's see little baby's reaction to the beach. Look. She's just looking at me. Oh yeah, you got the look camera at, in her face. Look at the beach. Look. What do you think? This is what it was all for. We love the beach, and we hope you love the beach. Yeah, if you don't love the beach, we're kicking you out of the family. Okay, that's not true. That's, well, that's how it works. She's gotta learn sometime. It's not true. If you don't love the water, you're dead to me. That's definitely not true. Anyway, this is, uh, this is like the first probably three or four minutes of this video. Hopefully, hopefully after I get out here in the morning, it's kind of overcast, not really a great day to set up a tent, um, but we'll set up a tent somewhere over here and, um, get everything done and ready to go and then I'll probably try to do some fishing, especially if the water's this calm. Alright guys, so I hope y'all enjoyed that little montage. We've had a great trip so far. It's actually day two or three. I don't even know. I have not really been fishing yet, so we're about to do that right now. We are at the rocks, so we're just going to climb these suckers. And we're going to fish this area. You can see the birds are already dive bombing bait, so I think we're in a good spot. It's usually a pretty good fishing spot up here, so I've got uh, some light spinning gear. And uh, we're going to see if we can hook into something. I don't even know what we're going to fish for, but we're going to fish. I've got several different baits, and we're going to take a look at those real quick. So I've got several different baits. I've got some stuff like this, some little paddle tails in this white and pink. I've also got it in a new penny, which is my favorite color. I've got some gulp alive salt water. I'm going to start off with a little jig head, uh, just a little bucktail jig head. Maybe we can get some flounder or something. I don't know. It really depends on what's here. If nothing else works, um, I've also got some bass stuff in there too, but we're gonna start off with that jig head. If nothing else works, I got some dropper loops and we'll uh, tie on some squid and uh, we'll toss that out there. Maybe we can get bit. So let's get, uh, let's get on my chest. Y'all jump on my chest. Let's go. I've got my backpack with all my baits, except for this gulp alive, which smells like absolute garbage. All right, so let's uh, target where these birds are targeting. I don't want to get soaked, so we're not going too far down there. Yeah, it's ought to be all right.
All right, here goes nothing, boys. Oh, we got bit by something. Is that or I hit a rock? Probably a rock. I'm gonna say a rock. That makes me feel better. Oh, I had something. I had something, boys. If only for a second. All right, let, all right, boys, let's move. So I've got a little secret to tell you guys. The shoes that I'm wearing, those boys right there, um, I love them a ton. And the company that makes them is actually a new sponsor. I haven't talked about them yet. It's coming, I promise. But the company reached out to me. It was like, hey, we'd love to uh, you to feature our shoes in your our, in your videos. They saw in one of my videos that I was wearing some old beat up. Number one, I wear Crocs a lot, but I was wearing some old beat up water shoes, and they were like, we make water shoes, and they're much better than the ones you're wearing. So how about you let us send you some? see what you think of them and if you'd like to partner together and i gotta tell you guys these shoes are legit i've had them in several episodes y'all may or may not have noticed them they were in the mtb video that just dropped this week but these shoes are about to be in a sponsored video one of the next ones i have coming up so y'all be on the lookout for that but uh they are legit all right, let's try right here. All right, let's hop down, change batteries, because this battery's already dead. It was going way too fast. We've only been out here for like 40 minutes, maybe. Fall back into the truck, get the big rod and reel. The old beef stick. Got some squid, we'll tie that on, we'll see what happens. All right, boys. Got the old big beef stick, here we go. Got two little chunks of squid on. We're just gonna chunk this thing out here. We got something. Yeah, we got something. We got splash too. Not sure what it is or how big it is, but we got something. Probably a catfish, I bet. How much you want to bet? Oh yeah, 100% catfish. How about that? You can drive all the way to the ocean still end up catching damn catfish now these dudes are strong and they got sharp little spines and they will prick you and then you can get a serious infection from it they ain't happy with me i don't blame you i'm not real happy with you i'm glad to have caught something but i really didn't want to catch you i'm probably gonna call that a day though there you go Nice little catfish. Got no idea what kind of catfish he is, but he's a catfish. Let these waves come up first. And we'll chunk him back in. Thank you. Now we ought to be easy for a minute. All right, come on, buddy. Back in the water he goes. All right. We got one on the dropper loop. We finally got one big enough to take it. I really need to rinse my hands off, but I don't trust that. There, that's good. Woo, got it done. All right, boys and girls, that's gonna do it for today's video. 
I hope y'all enjoyed it for uh, vacation vlog number one. I think there's only going to be like two of these. But our luck is going to change. That's the like the first fish I've caught all trip. Um, but I really haven't been trying until today. So that took about an hour. And uh, we got that fish. Unfortunately, it was a catfish. It wasn't anything like super cool, but it was a fish nonetheless. But tomorrow, we are going, and I say we because Chris is driving down from our home right now for the night. He's gonna stay the night at our place. Then tomorrow morning, we're going inshore fishing. We've got a charter. Um, it's the same company I used last year with Lojo. Um, so we're gonna fish with him. Hopefully, we're gonna get a couple videos done. We're trying to do an MTV inshore video, um, so stay tuned for that. If not, it'll just be an inshore video of just me and Chris just whaling on some fish. Um, hopefully, it'll be a good video. We're trying to target some redfish, sea trout, really anything that'll bite. I love inshore fishing just because you don't really know what you're going to get, especially if you're using live bait, uh, but we may be actually targeting some species, so that'd be really, really nice using some artificials. So you guys stay tuned for that. And uh, hopefully, you know, I'll let you know if we make it on the MTV channel or not. But if we do, I mean, good for us. That would be like, we're going for three in one month is really what we're trying to do. We were just on there just this week, and now we're trying to do two more. So guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you, uh, if you are new and you hung out through a vacation vlog, um, bless your heart because sometimes these are uh, not very interesting to people that don't actually know me. And if you would be so kind, since you've stuck it out this long and watched my family vacation part one, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button, turn it from red to gray, hit the ding dong notifications, like button, comment, y'all guys know what's up. And uh, for all my OG people that are uh, interested in this stuff, um, I really, really appreciate y'all following along. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you on the next one, later.